Hi everybody, I'm Steven Silva and I play Jean-Michel here in the Hodge or Fall. And uh, yeah, this is our second run. It's our rerun, so... <laughs> the one thing, of course, when you transition, there's a lot of, there's a lot of adjustment with theater, and I learned this a lot from coming from TV. Theater is so big. Theater is really huge. Like it's from like the movements, the expressions. Uh, everything needs to be really big because when you're in a theater, <laughs> real book. <laughs> uh, being in a the theater compared to TV, because if you're on TV, like like with the camera, it sees everything. But if you're in the theater, the main thing is you want to make sure everyone gets the same experience. So you need to do everything big because the person in the front row is not going to have the same experience as the person in the last row, unless you you know you make it your mission to make everything really big and expressive. So that was the main thing that I had a problem adjusting with because TV and theater are really different. They're really different mediums. There's a lot of work that goes into doing any type of play, musical. Um, but the thing is, when you watch it on stage, it looks like you know it looks like so easy. It looks like well oiled, but it's because of the work that you put in. So I think the discipline is like really rehearsing, doing your homework, uh, studying the script, uh, asking questions, just always making sure that you can do whatever you can to like you know really make everything work better. This is my third? Yeah, it is my third. Yeah. Yeah, it's, only, it's only my third. Yeah, my first one was Hope for the Flowers. I was a caterpillar. And then I became a rock star with Grease. I was Johnny Casino. And then here, I become the son of two gay men. Yeah, so it's fun. That's one thing that's nice. Yeah, I gotta jump around. Like, that's one thing that's nice with theater. I mean, like, there's, especially nowadays, I think, like, everyone is making plays and musicals about everything. So, um, I think it's one thing that's nice. You you really can't get bored because there's so many different like types of plays or there's many different types of genres that you can watch. So it's really cool. It's it's really cool because like I think one thing that's cool about this with Lahaj, if you look in the room, we have people that are ballet dancers, jazz dancers, actors, opera singers, and they're all coming together to do this play. So I think it's one thing that's cool about theater, like all these different classes that people can work together in something like this. Yeah, it's really like a big collaboration. And it's cool because I learned things from them. Like I learned things about ballet, I learned things about jazz dancing, I learned things about, you know, everything. So uh, I'm really thankful to be part of this. And one thing about this play, I mean, if you look at it with, because we have Tito Odi, Tito Michael, Tito Sheila, Noel, like all the, see uh, Nana and Raul. He told me, he's like, you know, you should really soak this up because if around just like those five people, that's around like a hundred plus years of experience. Oh, that's true. Right? So like, um, I think one thing is there's always a chance to learn, especially here. Yeah, with all the different mediums, like singing, dancing, acting, it's like happening at the same time. I would love to, yeah. I'd love to do this. I, one thing I want to try doing by the end of this year, I want to try doing a straight play. Because all I've done so far is just musicals. Nice. Yeah, musicals are nice, but I've heard stage plays, like straight plays. Yeah. That's a different like monster, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah, different discipline, different attack, different everything. So, I mean, you can't just like hide by like by singing or dancing, you know. It's all about the acting or different things. So I want to try it and experiment. Hi theater fans, Manila, this is Steven Silva and I'm inviting you all to come watch Lajajo Fo at the RCBC Theater, August 15th to September 6th. This is our rerun, so if you've watched it already, come watch again. And if you haven't watched it, this is the perfect time to watch it. It's a great show, it's fun, uh, there's a lot of funny stuff that happens and uh, you'll really enjoy it. And yeah. <laughs>